Good evening, everybody. It's Dragon Warrior here. Um, today we're going to show how to do the uh, Hellhound 45. This is for leveling up your special force units as quickly as possible. Now, the first thing you want to do is what I do is I recommend these straight line 45s. And here you'll see that the first thing I deploy is a heavy gunner. He is shopped to be immune to mine damage. The reason I recommend this base is because the mines are fairly easy to locate in this base to get in for your starting point. So what we want to do is we want to run him in over here off this left hand side. And we're just going to bring him up. He should hit a mine here shortly. Keep bringing him in. He's going to hit the second mine. Keep bringing him up. As soon as he hits this third mine on the left hand side here, right there, we'll back him out and he'll hit a fourth mine as he goes out. Now we're going to deploy our units. Yes, I'm using higher level units because I've leveled mine up quite a bit. However, this is the way to do it. Sheila has an M205 uh, grenade launcher, 203 grenade launcher, whatever they call that. And this heavy operator that you see here has a charged ordinance on him. I definitely recommend those. Uh, they definitely reduce them from the 20,000 that they were down to the 8,000 XP that, or uh, metals that they are now. First thing you want to do is open this wall here. take this wall out this is going to give us a good starting point and let's drop that and you'll see with that M205 launcher it just killed that now we're just going to hit the fist command and we're just going to let them walk in at this angle this is going to keep them with their 500 range out of range of even these plasma turrets and they're just going to kind of walk this base for us. Now these, if you don't have the um, shocked ordinance, once you get it open enough, drop a shock grenade on that. Drop a shock grenade on this. It's going to save you some attrition time. Unless you don't mind the extra attrition. Because these level up on twofold. One, the damage that they output. And two, the damage that they receive. Or the attrition that they take. Now you can scout the map, you know, bookmark, you know, five or ten of these at a time. Go in, hit one, take your tune home, reheal it, go hit the next one. I do this on a regular basis with all my SF tunes. I normally have anywhere from six to ten of these straight line Hellhound 45 bases. We're not worried really about the three additional metal deposits because, you know, the bonus metals. Because you're not going to take this base in one attack, um, even if you had all rank 20 units, um, you don't take this base in one attack. Now you see we were getting shot there, so we're going to back out here. Don't really worry about the shock trooper because you're really not going to take much damage off the shot guy. Now you'll see I'll stun this out because I've got that charge ordinance. That's where you would use a shock grenade if you don't have it. And then you can go right back to fist command for the fire at will. And you'll see, you know, where I showed you how to pop those four mines. That's going to be your starting point. You'll come in the same way on the second attack. If you're using a smaller platoon to try and heal them up, or uh, level them up faster, you know, you'll take those. It'll take you anywhere from two to three attacks. Um, with the platoon size that I have, it's going to take me most likely two attacks to get this base completely done. Every once in a while, you'll see I'll take control and I'll take certain key targets out and then go right back to the fist command. Let these come out and then I'm going to hit this right here, take it, fist command, take it, this is the fastest way 
to level your special force units up. You will net close to 1.2 mil XP on, say, Jeremiah or Sheila, something like that. You'll see I, I hit that up there. Key thing is once you have it open to a, a certain point, you want to make sure that you target those blitz turrets because they're going to give you the most attrition on your platoon. Uh, this way you can kind of keep moving the entire time frame and be able to open up the base. This one's actually going pretty fast. I may actually finish this in one attack. But then again, these are fairly high leveled units. Most of them are already ranked 20. I have a few that uh, still need a couple of levels to max out. You know, for where we're currently at in the game. But this right here is the best way that I have personally found to level up the units and get them done as quick as possible. And the faster that they level, the more damage that they'll deal. When I first started with this particular platoon, it was taking me three attacks to take this base. And then it dropped down to two. And it actually looks like the rest of them that are behind Sheila are leveling up to the point where I'm going to be able to take this base actually in one full attack. And I got all three of those. So it's going to be an additional 245 medals that you're going to gain. So you're killing two birds with one stone here. You're leveling all these units up. You're gaining the 200 medals plus the bonus once you uh, are able to obtain those. You're getting reses to be able to upgrade stuff. And you're getting that platoon leveled up. Now we'll just wait for this platoon to get home real quick. You can see it's got 25 seconds. Go ahead and I'm going to enter my base. I'll go into the platoon area. You can see it's still coming home. But that charge ordinance at the 8,000, definitely worth it. See that? 48 minutes, 15 seconds repair time. And that's the way that you will level these units up as quickly as possible. If you actually will take a look at this platoon, you'll see she's ranked 20, rank 20, rank 20, rank 20, rank 20. Second squad, he's a rank 18, rank 7, rank 7, rank 7, rank 7, or rank 20. These three level 7s, when I started that attack, were at rank 4. So they went up three levels. He's a rank 14, rank 6, rank 8, rank 6, and rank 8. So you can see you gained about two to three levels, you know, on each of those platoon while you were doing that. Hope you all enjoyed the video. Go out, get some, get them leveled up.